This is Newsham Park. It was opened originally in 1874 as an orphanage for the education and support of orphans of British seamen. The conditions that the orphans faced were often seen as harsh and cruel, with siblings being separated and even one former resident quoted that they weren't fussy how they punished you. The orphanage eventually closed in 1951 and became Newsham Park Hospital. In 1954, however, the hospital developed its own psychiatric department and received an influx of patients with severe mental problems. This hospital has countless spooky rooms, corridors and basements, and the lunatic asylum still possesses wheelchairs, mortuary fridges and original furniture, including an electric shock machine. Although the building has laid empty for many years, there have been numerous reports of paranormal activity here from security staff and workmen. One workman even said, I will never enter that building again as it is evil. And we're here. I can't tell you how excited I am for today. I've been really looking forward to coming to this place. Look at it. Fantastic. Hopefully some of that B-roll showed some of the um, uh, facility. Um, now, this is very popular with a lot of paranormal teams. This is my first time, so I'm really hoping that we can get something today. I'm yet to see something convincing at the moment, um, but I'm very open-minded for it all. Bit of a skeptic, I won't call something unless I see it. So anyway, come and join me and let's see if we catch something tonight. Oh, this is the old cinema room. The original chairs in here. This is huge. Where's the coffin? Where you should do dead bodies. You've got all that. So you've got a coffin there. <coughs> Sorry, clear my throat there. Coffin where you should bring the dead bodies in. Oh my god. So at the moment we're going out with have um, just been shown around the uh, JP and Kimmy, and later on we'll get a chance to go out on our own. Really looking forward to that one. <laughs> we need a dog barking outside. <laughs> you won't catch me in there. So what we're doing now, uh, JP? Big call on. All right, okay. Big call on. Get energy off and see what we can do. Nice. We're going to go to our ward. It's quite active. All right, okay. Is that Wardy, is it? That's Wardy? Yeah, I've read about it. Wardy, this is all new to me. This is creepy. It's massive. Hello. We're here. You get a variety of smells in every room, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. I absolutely love this room. Yeah, it's creepy. Anybody come in? This is still... Um, not focusing properly. Mm -hmm. Give it to me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's that? Oh. If you want the telly, come and touch it. So the telly has to be touched or squeezed for it to go off, but sometimes it does send out some quite... What's your name? Okay, so, so it does send so that's out... So that's just setting stuff out yeah. to... Cool. I just felt a coolness in my arm just before that ball went off. Did you? Yeah. yeah. That half my arm's in the fridge. Is it? You know? That's strange. Anybody in this room, can you make a noise, please? Lower your voice. Lower your voice. No. <laughs> no, no. Attic. Does that say? Attic. Attic. Yeah. Yeah. Attic. Well, an attic could be the naughty boys' room, really, couldn't it? But Charlie, you still have them? Yeah, just gone cold. Yeah. Keep getting like a breeze around it. Yeah, same yeah, here, over here. Yes, yeah, that's exactly what I got. Like. Breeze, it's cold. Yeah, it's ice cold. Yeah, ice yeah. cold, my right hand side. It's not, it's not an uncomfortable feeling. No, no, but it's ice cold. Yeah. It's like an ice cold wind. 
Who's holding that drink? It's going to get my eddy meter out here because there's temperature change. <laughs> Well, it's going yeah, off now. That's yeah. Right, that's so Lilith's gone off. Right, Lilith doesn't go off. The, um, the temperature's dropping loads when I'm putting it in the car. And then when I bring it back up, the temperature's just shooting up. And it's dropping as soon as I'm pointing it near the car. Shall we put the car, shall we move the car? Right, it's still, the still car? dropping actually. Yeah, the temperature's dropping. Shall we move the car? Maybe we put it behind <coughs> Adele? Yeah. We've dropped a. Oh, hang on a minute. Where do you want it to go then? Where do you want the car to go? Show me. I'm leaning. I don't know. Oh, sacrifice made. Do we have someone else here? Do we have someone else here with us as well? Well, just got a um, reading on the editor meter there. Humidity reading, yeah, pressure meeting, right. sorry. Yeah. I'm just saying, you've not been filming, have you? Mine's on the other place. Is there anyone else with us? Because I think sacrifice is um, a big word for a little one, isn't it? I've got something else. Mike. Mike. Mm. You have a mic there. Mike. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you like Mike? Feel free to come and say hello. I'm very friendly. Or are we talking to a mic? Grandmother. Grandmother? I haven't got one. No, that's what I mean. Yeah. Do you have a message for Mike, who's in the room with us? Oh. Vapour, oh my God. That's what you work at. <laughs> That's it, yeah. That's my job. <laughs> wow. Vapor. Wow. Can I just say as well, would you say your vapour just be behind you before? There was like a, like a mist that went to the left ear. This side? Yeah, and as I was taking the picture, every land I was taking. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Does that Whoa. make sense? It says land now. Well, that could be anything. Could be anything, yeah. That's really cool, that is. That is, that very, is very, very that's good. Very that is very good. I'm take a picture of that. That is very intelligent. So I had my name out there. And also, what about the word vapour? So we're done here now. We're going to head back downstairs to the main um, dining room, I think. Um, got a few responses here, it's especially the one about my name and, and vapour. <laughs> Before we go into the main hall, we're just coming downstairs to the locker area. Come on, look at this footprint, it's got toes, toe prints. Look at that! What's in here? Oh, that's, that's alright. Oh, yeah, that's actually better. I can see it better without it. Yeah, that one there. The toes. Oh, wow, look at that one. That. Now, could you put your foot beside it? Um, JP, just to give it an idea. So there you go. So that's a child's footstep there. It's just appearing on the ground. It's mental. So this is a locker room. In this room, obviously, it was a locker room where they used to come and get changed. If you look on all the lockers, there's still original name tags and original stuff around. There you go. Eddie Proud put that. No, I just found one with a name on, that was about it. Yeah, so this is the locker room. Those footsteps are amazing. Let's have a look again. Yeah, it's little kids' footsteps. Can you tell us something that's relevant to this building or where we're at? Right, that's well, a few things going off here now. You're going to have to make it really clear though, because there's lots of things going on. We've got someone out doing the Estes method as well. I like to play games. Do you? We like to play games too. Can you make that um, prayer go off again, please? Thank you. If there's somebody here, come and touch my little device here, it won't hurt you. Right. I wonder if we've got someone religious with us. Yeah. 
Here, here. Here, here. Mm. Yeah. Okay, make that go off again, that light that you've been playing with, the prayer. Thank you very much. There you go. Do you think? <laughs> wow. I got goosebumps all over as well. Really? I can't even see you, where are you? Here. In here. <laughs> right, okay. Well, it's absolutely pitch black in here. It is. Right. Down here. Apparently we've seen a shadow figure down here. Yeah, down here. Right. It's peaking, it's peaking and then going back in. Forced. Everyone's something. Everyone's something. And forced on the got every, Everyone's down something. Everyone's something. Down here. Peeking around the corner and going back. Me and JP have just seen it. If you look where that door is, the door, the, the centre the center window in that door, it peaks and then comes back. Oh, there's a noise there. What was that? Now it's locked. There was a noise as well that we've heard just now. Yeah, I was going to say, open. is that open? It's open. <laughs> It is absolutely wow. pitch black in here. No, I didn't see anything just yet. Never mind. Can we just like kill the lights and come back out here and we'll see if it'll do it again? When you said it peaks, which through that middle window was it? The middle window. Right on the door. If, yeah, because yeah? if you if you turn the lights off, you see yeah. another light coming from behind that yeah. window, and then the other two main lights. It literally was doing like this. If this is the middle door, it went like this. Me and JP, both sorry, it went like that. And then it covered the window, and it went, back went again. away, and then JP said, it's peaked, it's peaked. So we're just heading over to the Naughty Boys room section. So what do these look like inside? Have a these, are these all them here? So these are little boys' rooms, naughty boys' rooms. Oh wow! So this is where they would. Uh, it's actually pitch black in there. I can't see nothing. Um, but yeah, if you were naughty, you'd be put on one of these. How long would you be put on one of these for, JP? Three days. Two for three days. I will right. say, I will say, if someone picked up on the wall, something happened, something right. happened in one of these things. Right, well, I'll, I'll go into one of these. Yeah, you go into uh, my set of REM pods down there. Okay, I'm going to go into one of these and bring my, uh, my little ghost tube out. Let's see if I get anything. Right, so here we go. I can't actually see anything in here. Wow, this is really tight in here. This is really tight in here. And then you'd be stuck in here. You'd be stuck in here for. Hang on, this is a bit bright. There you go. Um, you'd be stuck in here for up to three days if you were naughty. Look at look at it. This is all I've got. This is all the room I've got in here. See, look. That's it. That's it. There's the door. And this is all I've got. So. I'm going to put my um, ghost tube app thing on there and just see what we get. Very freaky. So, uh, there's the top. <laughs> it's literally, you know, it is absolutely tiny here. I'm not even a bench. I suppose they'd sit here with their backs up against the wall. I've got my backpack on at the moment, so. You shouldn't be here. Oh dear. Why is that then? Why shouldn't I be here? I don't mean any disrespect. I'm just trying to put myself back to how you guys were. Could be just the battery. Back in the day, you know? Do you want me to leave here? I'll leave if you like. Just let me know. <laughs> someone just came in there. <laughs> Is it like they walked in and saw someone sat in the toilet? It's leading to the reaction. Let's 
That's what I'm using, that's what that uh, message came from. But that was a bit um that was a bit strange that message, you shouldn't be in here. First message that came out of there. Do you have anything else you want to say? I'd like to communicate with you if possible. No, no, no. Let me know if you want me to leave. I know you said I shouldn't be here, but let me know if you want me to leave. It's almost like someone was in here and was saying you shouldn't be in here because they were in here. Can you write your name for us? You should be shush. Right, not getting much more. Interesting though. Can you take it back to the centre please? Yeah. Yeah, it's spinning. When I come up, when I went and see Mother the other day, I asked right, her. Right, I would say to take your glass of goodbye, please, Spirit. Take it to because goodbye. I, got, I love you because. It started counting. Yeah. Right, thanks, it's already started counting from me. All right. So, what was that? What, what is that then? This is this isn't a Ouija board. So. No, this is glass. Oh, right, okay. Um, so, okay. You just ask a question, yes or no. Um, it started counting down. I see, yeah. And if it goes down, it's right. dangerous. Right, I see. Okay. So, we've just come across this naughty boy's room. Um, just D e Ward. And apparently, this one is where a little boy died. They locked him in here for three or four days. I forgot he was in here. Very sad. Right, well I was going on my own and then I chickened out. So I'm now with um, Debbie and Sarah, who are JP's relatives, which is nice. And then we have Ben, just down the bottom there. <laughs> and I have no idea where we're heading, because every time I turn the corridor here, I get lost. Right, we're now in yeah, the locker room where we had a bit of activity earlier, if you remember. Back in the video we had yeah. all the REM pods going off, balls going off, yeah. so we've set up a laser grid here and we've also got the eddy meter down there just to measure any um, temperature changes or maybe pressure changes or humidity, a um, couple of um, EMF meters um, and I might even set up the spirit box here just to see if we get anything coming through. Is there anyone here that wishes to communicate with us? I'll just put on the voice recorder, see if we get anything through that sometimes to do. Come and say hello to us. We don't mean you any harm at all. Can you give us a sign that, you, that you're here? Perhaps give us a, a little tapping sound. You may be overwhelmed by all this electrical stuff you're seeing here, but it's, it won't hurt you, I promise. If you come close to any of these things, it'll just let us know that you're here. It will not hurt you. No, I don't think we're getting anything down here now. No. Yeah. Mm. yeah, absolutely. <laughs> right, so this is, um, we're heading towards the Electric shock chair. So this is So this was used. This wasn't for the kids, was it? This wasn't for the kids. This is for the patients. Patients, yeah. This is patients. Someone want to get on the chair so I can take a picture. Okay. And uh, who's turning? Who's turning it on? 
ずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずずそういうことです。そういうことです。Whereas this one, it might have been if someone was ill, but it could have been for anything, really. But it's stuff like this, isn't it? Like, that's yeah. just been left around. Hey, yeah. like, that. People used yeah. it. So Worth your bob, that. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Pete, you didn't bring your hearse today. You could have loaded it up with a few bits, you know what I mean? <laughs> right, you say the oh. one downstairs is definitely living for bodies. Oh, yeah. yeah. You've got the cover on well, The morgue is near there, but we can't use the morgue because it's dangerous. The morgue? Yeah, so oh so God! When, when you go it gets out worse. Of it, you'll see a big chimney, and that's where. Used to burn bodies. Oh! What was that? Yeah. <laughs> 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 that impressive. I just wanted to share. These are the uh, anti-suicide cages, things that are put on the side of the stairs. Does it go all the way up? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Let's have a look. Let's see how far that goes. Yeah, it goes all the way up to the top. Yeah, that's true. Stay down here. Yeah. Might get some energy here. All right. So we're just standing at the bottom of the stairs. We thought that maybe because this would have been a place that people would have unfortunately landed in. There's quite a massive temperature drop about me. Really? Yeah. There's a temperature drop, is there? Yeah. yeah you can feel it. You can feel it. There's no draft. Yeah, yeah you can't feel mm. it. It's still there. What was it before then? Uh, 160. Right. 560, sorry. Five, five degrees is... Uh, yeah. It's a big change. Yeah. All right, let me get my ghost box out. Ghost chips, shall I say. Let's see if we get any words come through. All right, here we are. Is this where you died? Could you not take the pain any wrong? Is there anything you want to say to us? Oh, my mouth's gone a little bit numb. Definitely feels a bit. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So, if anybody here, do you want to tell us anything? Is there anything you'd like to tell us? We're not going to bring you to any harm. We just want to communicate with you. Was that a look? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But it could be anything. Yeah, there. so many people around here yeah. now that we don't know. Yeah. But there was a knock, yeah. Yeah. Give us a sign. If that was you knocking, could you do it again? Five. 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 Yeah. Are you five? Are there five of you here? Were you five when you died? Or was it five people that died?
Do you regret it? Did you regret what you did? Right, we've not been down here. Um, I don't know what it is. Oh, that's better. Oh, put your eye back on. What's in here? Yeah. <coughs> I'll tell you what, this, immediately I get a strange vibe in here. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a bit weird. Yeah. Come in. It's like a psychedelic wallpaper, isn't it? <laughs> oh dear. I wonder what this is. It's like a changing room or something, isn't it? A long part when it was open. It was like a long yeah. Well, it could have been, yeah. With the shelving there. Yeah. I bet all that's original. Probably well it will be, won't it? Yeah. But then all the old boards and that Stuff on the floor. Well the fact that this is all cracking, there's all the stuff on the floor yeah, there. Got to watch the yeah, got to watch yeah, the ceilings. Yeah, got all the coming down there and What's this flashing phone, Mike? You can come up with a triangle. Triangles, EMF. Right, okay. So you get an electric magnetic field coming through. Right. Right. Oh, wow. Wow. <coughs> That's amazing. It is a washroom. You've done it again. Is it? Yeah. Flashing at the minute. Oh, it's gone now. It is. Look what's that? Ooh, shit. <laughs> yeah, it looks freaky, that does. Yeah. Yeah. It's so not being at the back. <laughs> so it's a nice shot off. Yeah. All the front. Yeah, that looks better. Look in here. Yeah, it's all falling apart. Oh, it's all falling apart. Yeah, I'm more scared of the ceiling falling on my head than the ceiling. <laughs> Absolutely. Mind you, they've probably knocked it down themselves. And, uh,. The loose bits, yeah. Don't get anything on there. Toilet again. Toilet. Is there any water in there? Is that one? Like, what is that? It's not, is it? No, it's just. Anything here? Going green, a little triangle again, is there? Yeah. Yeah. So close to some sort of energy. Is there anybody down here? Is there anyone in the house? Are you doing open doors? I don't know. Oh, God's sake. Look at this. Oh, 4.4. It just come up on that 4.4. Wow. What is that, millimetre? Yeah. It's lockers, more lockers. Yeah. So we're getting at the moment um, a reading on the ghost tube with EMF and also in the mill pot. <laughs> That just went straight up to 4.4 on there. Isn't that a yeah, I imagine it reads EMF as well, not just um, yeah. yeah, not yeah. just uh, temperature. Old metal locker. Lockers used to have. Oh, wow. God, there we are. Getting on a bit. Do you reckon these are original? We like it, don't we? Uh, yeah, Graham Jeffers. With these workers, do you think? What should I do? As to what? Mm. What should I, I don't, do? I don't know. What should you do? You tell us what you should do. We don't mean you no harm. Just come in to have a little music. Do you want us to leave this area? If you want us to leave, give us a sign. <laughs> 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 Did we go in here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, we didn't actually. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's going up again, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. This is the trouble around here. Be careful. Right, can we get this right, I, think, I think maybe we need to get out. Let's go, you go first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, be careful. Let's go. I do, there's a funny feeling down here. Yeah, I agree. Look at that behind you. No, you're not, I agree. <laughs>
But, so we're getting a bit of activity around there at the moment. Um, just even outside in the yard, we've got uh, Ghost Tube um, reading EMF and coming up with warning triangles. And we've had the male meter spiking up as well. And then what was what was the word we had on there? Hang. Hang. And we were talking about hanging curtains. How creepy does this look? It's weird how it's just like that. And, uh, it's so creepy, doesn't it? Especially, especially now it's got dark. It's like, wow. It's what you see on telly. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's amazing. Yeah. Look at it. It's actually amazing. But you don't people used to be in there. I know. And this was the old chapel. The kids that were locked up. Yeah. And they've they done nothing no. wrong. I mean, there's no room to move. No. So we're just having a debate here whether this is the chimney for the incinerator of the morgue, which would be there if that is the case. But we also have a chimney there. Don't know if the camera's picking it up, but just there. Not that I want to go and visit that anyway, but there we go. <laughs> right, so that brings us to the end of today's hunt. Um, thoroughly enjoyed this place. A lot more to, to be discovered here, but we couldn't seem to access a lot of the areas. I'm not sure why, I'm not sure if that's the norm. Um, did we see much paranormal activity? Um, nothing really, again, that I can say that, you know, categorically has happened. I did find a photo which I'll enclose now. Let me know what you think. Um, there was no one that fit that description. I thought maybe JP was the one that was there, but he was behind me at the time. Um, so a um, bit strange, but um, but yeah, really, really enjoyed it. Again, hook up these, with these guys, JP and Kimmy from Occult Hauntings. Um, they're very accommodating. Prices are very reasonable for a lot of these places. These places can be very expensive to try and uh, come and visit, um, unless you're obviously an urban explorer, but then you take a risk. But with that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you next time.